Yo, what is going on guys? It's Event Advisor here and I'm bringing you guys a brand new video today. And today, I'm just going to be making another cut comp because, you know, the last one did pretty decently, pretty decent and, uh, you know, they're kind of fun to make and I want to get better at, uh, being able to talk and play at the same time, you know, because I'm freaking garbage at that. So as you guys know, I'm actually going for the Rewind Alliance RC, uh, as a director and, uh, I'm actually pretty excited for it. Hopefully I can make it in because I think it actually can boost my channel, uh, boost my channel up a lot. Um, and subscribers and stuff like that. Um, I've been told by a lot of people that it's not, you know, the best team. But, you know, I'm just a smaller YouTuber going for a team. It's actually, I want to be in a team so bad. And, uh, you know, Rewind Alliance is probably the most reasonable team I can go for right now. There are some uh, other art, um, recruitment challenges going out there. But a lot of them are just kind of like out of my range of reasonableness. Um, but yeah, so I think I think this is gonna be awesome going for this uh, recruitment challenge So as you guys know Call of Duty World War 2 is actually coming out this year in November November 3rd I think it's coming out and you know, it has a lot of talk around YouTube and a, a lot of um, Just mixed feelings about the game because apparently there's gonna be like no kill cams um, Apparently there's like no real perks and no create class uh, create a class and stuff like that um, It's all done pretty much through divisions and, you know, um, I think it's kind of weird that they're doing it like that. But, you know, we actually need... I, I, I'm kind of glad, actually, because it's actually going to be something new. Other than just the same old crap that Call of Duty pulls out. Because, uh, I'm not going to lie. The, like, the most recent Call of Duties that have came out are not, you know, not, in my opinion, very good. And I think a lot of people can say that as well. But, you know, I'm pretty excited for this new Call of Duty that's coming out. I'm actually going to be picking it up. Um, I was, I was kind of thinking of not going to, um... I actually had a long talk with my friend about it for uh, yesterday, and he said he's not picking it up, but I think I'm actually going to pick it up and make some videos on it, and, uh, you know, I'm actually really excited for it because it's going to be something different. It's not just going to be the same old stuff, and it's actually going to be not flying jetpacks and where you can jump 30,000 feet up in the air, and, you know, it's not going to be like that, like how the recent Call of Duties. But yeah, guys, the, the new Call of Duty is coming out, and I'm actually, I'm, I'm pretty excited for it now. Uh, I've been watching so many videos on it, and... I actually just watched T. Martin's recent video on the no perks uh, aspect of it. I think that guy just like turned on a mod menu or something. It looked like he was like knifing and jumping and stuff. Um, but yeah, T. Martin just released a new uh, like a Call of Duty like review kind of thing saying that um, like there's going to be no perks and stuff. He explained it in such good depth and detail. Um, so I don't really know much about it, but if you guys want to go check that out, definitely go check it out. You guys will learn so much about the, the perk situation. It's just all gonna be done through divisions, and it's gonna it's gonna be something new, and um, I'm pretty excited about it. So there's actually one more thing I want to talk about: World War II, uh, the world, new Call of Duty coming out. Um, that the kill cam feature is not gonna, or the kill cam is not gonna be a thing. Um, it's actually gonna be play of the game, I think it is. So like saying like if you get like a quad feed or like a triple headshot or just like you do something like that, um, depending on what it is, it'll be showed at the end instead of just showing the final kill cam. Uh, which is, which is pretty cool, but, you know, for trick shotting, it's kind of, like, not, it's not cool, in a sense, for trick shotting, because, you know, you can't, you're not hitting a trick shot, if you hit a trick shot for the final kill cam, it's most likely not gonna show it, unless you hit, like, a, a triple, fine, a trick shot kill cam, or, like, a quad, but, I don't know, that's gonna be so difficult, but trick shotting's still gonna be a thing, I'm, I'm assuming, so, that's gonna be alright, but just, the, the ending... When they show the kill cam and stuff, it's not going to be the trick shot most most likely. Unless there is those freaking freaks out there that can hit quad kill cams and they hit a dope shot. That's going to be insane. But yeah, guys, if you guys are enjoying these cut comms and stuff like this, this kind of new stuff, um, let me know down in the comments below and smash the thumbs up button because um, it'll really let me know because uh, I don't really know if like you guys enjoy this stuff. Well, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today. I actually... I don't know if I'm going to show what I just did, but I just hit a trick shot. I didn't jump. It was the shittiest trick shot I've ever shot in my entire life. I don't know if I'm going to show it. But if you guys did enjoy this video, definitely smash the thumbs up button. Hit the subscribe button down below. And yeah, like I said, if you guys are enjoying these uh, cut comms and stuff like that, I'm sorry I do not have a face cam. I actually lost my face cam, so I can't really show my face, of course. I'll probably pick, uh, be picking one up sometime this summer, though. Um, so I'll be doing face cam later on. And uh, yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys later. Peace. I'm the one that hit that same spot. Hit it. She the one that bring them raindrops. We go back, remember Chris Cross and Hopscotch.